uh, verse 9. Wherefore God also hath highly exalted him, and given him a name which is above every name, that at the name of Jesus every knee should bow, of things in heaven, and things in earth, and things under the earth, and that every tongue should confess that Jesus Christ is Lord, to the glory of God the Father. Now here where it talks about confess, the term Paul uses is a strong intensive verb which means agree with or say the same thing. Essentially Paul is saying that everyone will unanimously affirm what God the Father has already stated. And it references Isaiah 45 verse 23. Essentially, Paul is saying that everyone will unanimously affirm what God the Father has already stated, that Jesus Christ is Lord. And I've often tried to wonder and imagine what that would look like, but, you know, with my, with this finite mind that we all have, I, it's, it's pretty much impossible. I think it's going to be even more grand than, than we can imagine. I mean, can you imagine every, every single person in the whole world... Uh, uh, I heard somewhere, uh, I, th I think somebody on SBN uh, had stated this, that he, and I don't know where he got this from. Uh, he read it in a study or of some sort. Um, they said on there, that this gentleman said on there, that they, est the, they estimate that the total population of the world, every, uh, the total population of the world, the number of people who have ever existed in the history of the world came out to about 117 billion people and that's a number that is so staggering you know you're basically saying that Jesus Christ took on the sins of 117 billion people it's it's crazy and you know this verse here and that's an estimate, by the way, about 117 billion. I think that's the highest that they estimated. It was somewhere between like 105 and 117 billion. But we'll use the 117 as, as the most. Um, basically, you know, this verse talking about every knee, this passage here talking about every knee should bow and every tongue confessing that Jesus Christ is Lord. Can you imagine a, a, a grand sort of room or something or wide open space and you got 117 billion people bowing down and confessing at the exact same time at the exact same moment that Jesus Christ is Lord <laughs> that is going to be some crazy experience it really will you know because it's what it says everybody's going to do that you know so you're talking about somewhere between 105 and 117 billion people all bowing down and, and confessing that Jesus Christ is Lord. I mean, it's incredible. It's absolutely staggering. And <laughs> I mean, I mean, I'm even getting all <laughs> bent out of shape just thinking about it. I mean, it, it, it's so amazing what, what God, what, what, how, what God is and, and, and God's personality and, and, and the nature of God. 